He's traveled the world. He's studied the ways of the ancient masters. How'd you do that? Some say he's a master of his art form. What I say, pick a card. Any card. Here, just take one, just take one. All right, uh, show it to your friends, show it to the camera. When you're done, you let me know. Tell me when to stop. Okay, go ahead, put it back. I don't know what card you just chose, but I know the exact order of this deck of cards. Have you ever used a pocket knife? Yes, you have. All right, you're gonna, you're gonna stab these cards and you're gonna go to your selected card in that deck. Are you ready? All right. So what was the name of the card? King of Hearts. King of Hearts? Yeah. That is the 14th card in this deck. 13, I'm getting 13. Okay, go, go nice on your knees. Nice kids, don't play with dice. We're professional tonight. Go check it out. Do you think I got 13? One, two, three, 11, 12, 13. 13. King of Hearts, go ahead, turn around. Backstab doesn't make you look like another magician, but it makes you look like you've developed a skill for years. And the greatest thing about it is that there's no skill required. This trick is really edgy, so if you like stuff like this, Charlie is going to tap the top of the card and your card should rise to the top. This trick probably isn't for you, but if you want to be a little edgier, I probably present Backstab.